So I can close off my studio from my bedroom. It's off my master bedroom with this big barn door. It actually opens up into my master bedroom right there. So I can get a little bit of peace and quiet. But let me flip the camera around and show you the setup here. So I have a nice ring light. What we do is we actually mount my phone right here and it shoots me that way. We've got some added lighting there. Um, we've got the monitor, obviously, that I put in the background, so I sit there. And what I have in front of me is uh, my computer I built at home. This is uh, basically my, my rig that I built from scratch. I log into the station so I can see real time. That's actually a Skype uh, camera, and so I, via Skype we can see real time. I log into my graphics right there, and I can control my graphics in real time. I've got an extra monitor, and then I use my laptop with... Um, my AirPod that I'm actually using Skype to call in there to hear what's going on at the station. So this is kind of what I see. Um, and this is just my home office setup. Occasionally I'll go back outside um, and do this outside because I can do it all from my phone. So when I'm sitting down, this is what I'm looking at right there, my camera and that ring light. And what people see at home is basically this shot right here. This is a glimpse into my work from home life with my two babies. Hi. In the space Hi. where I'm doing a lot of my work from home. There's not a whole bunch to see right now. Um, but yeah, we're doing our best to make sure that they're doing their school work and staying up to yes. speed and I'm trying to help them with that as best I can while also doing my work as much as I can from home. You can see I've got hairstylists here with me. Um, which includes FaceTime interviews and emails and Zoom conference calls and all of the stuff that I know you guys are all doing as well. Um, so we're making it work. We're going to get through this. Yep. So this is how I work right now. Uh, my fiance tucked me into the corner of the bedroom because she says I'm loud and she can't concentrate. But uh, she gave me this picture to look at and I got a window that I can stare outside when I need to imagine myself somewhere other than this home. But when I'm not working in that little corner over there, I'm working at the dining room table. You can see I got my uh, setup here. Uh, this is what I use to plug into my cell phone so I can record audio. It's a little microphone that I just clip, and uh, the audio comes out pretty well. I'm not using it now, but uh, you get the idea. I put uh, the phone on this tripod right here, and typically I drag the chair right around here somewhere so that we have this TV screen in the background. And I try to put a Channel 9 logo up here, but my internet has been spotty lately, so at least once... There goes the tripod. We're going to sign. Oh, Nancy. He's uh, very camera shy, but he has uh, made some appearances in uh, the background of my shots occasionally. So that's a little bit about how I'm working right now. Um, and, you know, we're, we're all getting through this. We're all making television happen. Everybody's doing something different, but the most important thing is that the viewers get the information. Uh, something that we have just figured out how to do in the past week and a half, which so many of you guys, so many parents across both Carolinas are figuring out how to do, how to have a child homeschooled while you're also trying to do your own stuff. I am pregnant right now, six months, and so WBTV has made the smart and safe and appreciated decision to have me at home for the first half of my day. So I'm not anchoring the early evening shows, but I am going in at 8 o'clock to be there to anchor the 11 o'clock. Um, and that is because we have so few people. There have been a lot of modifications at WBTV, and we have so, so, so few people there at night after 8 o'clock that it feels very safe for me to be there and still be anchoring the 11 o'clock show. But for early evenings, I am here working with my daughter, who's in third grade. She's working on third grade stuff right now, and this is what we figured out. We set up a little home office in a uh, hallway near the garage at a desk. And she's doing all of her own Zoom meetings and Google Classroom and Raz Kids and different things through CMS and the teachers. And at any given time, I'm sitting here working beside her. Um, I was just working on Facebook stuff. A five-year-old could walk through at any given moment. He just did. Um, or a big dog could stop barking. So sometimes it makes for interesting Zoom meetings. So that's our home office. That's what we're figuring out as so many people are figuring it out. I actually just got home from working the morning shift. I'm one of the anchors on Good Day Charlotte. And this week is my rotation to be the solo anchor in studio. But last week I was working from home because 
We're all in club quarantine, and this was basically the setup. It sort of packed up and moved into the corner uh, to be out of the way. But this is the living room, a bar cart, bar stools, and because I'm married to a former news videographer, I had not one, but two lights. So I had network level lighting from the living room. Never thought I'd be doing my job during a global pandemic, but we're taking it as it comes and continuing to do our jobs each day.